Well, good evening. Thanks for joining us. Scary moments in Flagstaff tonight as a powerful monsoon storm leads to flash flooding. Emergency sirens were going off within the city of Flagstaff. Flagstaff telling residents in the affected areas to seek shelter and stay on higher ground as the raging water moved through. And this happening in the burn scar of the pipeline fire and some of these same residents were dealing with this just 24 hours ago. We talked to Dave Zorn with KAFF News Radio in Flagstaff and he described how quickly things went from clear skies to a dangerous downpour. Pretty calm day, a few storms hit and miss around, but nothing huge like we were expecting. Then about 4.30, everything popped over the peaks. It hit over the uh, museum fire burn scar and over the Schultz pipeline uh, scar, both. Meeting out here at Doney Park last night, uh, we were out there at that, and there's people out here at Doney think, well, the Schultz fire didn't get us. Why would we be worried? We're worried now that yesterday happened, and here's another warning shot today, uh, where a lot of these areas that weren't in flood zones before because of Schultz, are in flood zones now because of pipeline. But one good thing I'll tell you is that all the mitigation stuff that was built after the Schultz fire about 12 years ago seemed to be working. I mean, all the canals and all the, uh, the, the diversion ponds, all that kind of stuff, that was working. Nothing was spilling over canal banks or anything like that. 89 never closed, never, didn't spill over there. Um, so, you know, as of right now, everything looks pretty good coming from today, but you know, it's, it's a daily thing up here. Uh, we just never know when we're gonna get hit, so. And take a look at this video taken by 12 News weather watcher Mark Jones. It shows a storm cell sitting over Mount Eldon, not moving and just dumping all of that rain, which is of course causing the flooding. There was a flash flood warning until 830 tonight. 